Have you ever wondered how data analysts seem to pull insights out of thin air or make sense of mountains of messy data? Well, I've got news for you. It's not magic, it's SQL. If you're new to the data world or you've heard about SQL but aren't sure how it fits into your toolkit, you're in the right place. My name is Daniel and in today's video we are diving into everything you need to know about SQL as a data analyst. We'll talk about what SQL is, why it's so important for your career and how you can learn it step by step from the basics all the way to advanced concepts. Along the way, I'll share tips and insights to help you get started, build confidence, and start tackling real-world data challenges like a pro. By the end of this video, you will have a clear SQL roadmap. Guys, make sure you check out all the useful links in the description after watching this video. There might be some nice discounts there. Ready to unlock one of the most powerful tools in the data world? Let's jump in! What is SQL? So, my friends, let's start with the basics. What is SQL? It stands for Structured Query Language, which sounds kind of fancy. But in simple terms, it's the language that lets you talk to databases. Think of it as the way you can ask a computer to fetch, organize, or even change data for you. Imagine you are sitting on a mountain of data. Maybe it's customer information, sales figures, or website traffic. SQL is like your magical tool that helps you find exactly what you need in that mountain. You can use it to pull out insights, clean messy data, or even combine data from different places. And the best part, it's not as hard as it sounds. Trust me, once you get the hang of it, you'll feel like a data wizard. Why do you need to learn SQL as a data analyst? Now, I know some of you might be wondering, do I really need SQL if there are tools like Excel or Power BI? The answer is 100% yes, guys. Let me explain why. As a data analyst, you'll often deal with large datasets that live in databases. Tools like Excel are great, but they just can't handle the volume or complexity that SQL can. SQL gives you the power to directly access these databases and do things much faster and more efficiently. But it's not just about speed. SQL also gives you flexibility. You're not limited to the predefined features of software tools. Instead, you can write your own queries to answer super specific questions, clean data in unique ways, and even build datasets exactly how you want them. If you're serious about the career in data analytics, SQL isn't just nice to have, it's a must. The ultimate guide to learning SQL. Alright, so how do you actually learn SQL? Guys, it's all about starting with the basics and building up from there. You don't need to know everything at once. In fact, most analysts only use a handful of commands on a daily basis. So the trick is to focus on what matters most for your role. The great thing about SQL is that it's pretty logical. Once you understand a few core ideas, everything else starts to fall into place. You'll start with simple queries, like selecting data from a table, and then move on to more advanced stuff, like joining tables and creating your own databases. By the time you are done, you will feel like you can tackle any dataset out there. Basic concepts. Okay, let's talk about the basics. This is where everyone starts and trust me, you don't need to be a coding genius to get this. At its core, SQL is about interacting with tables. A table is basically like a spreadsheet with rows and columns, and SQL lets you manipulate it however you want. You'll start with commands like SELECT, which is how you ask the database to show you specific data. Then there's WHERE, which lets you filter that data, and ORDER BY, which helps you organize it. These are the bread and butter of SQL. And once you get the hang of them, you'll already be doing some pretty powerful stuff. But it's not just about querying data. You'll also learn how to clean it. For example, you might use SQL to remove duplicates or to fix formatting issues. These small steps might seem simple, but they're the foundation for everything you'll do as an analyst. Intermediate SQL. Now, my friends, once you've got the basics down, it's time to level up. This is where SQL gets really fun, and you start to see how much you can actually do with it. At this stage, you will learn about joins. These are super important because real-world data often lives in multiple tables. Joins let you combine those tables to create a single dataset. For example, you might have one table with customer information and another with purchase data. Using joins, you can connect the two and see what each customer bought. You will also dive into functions. These are like little helpers that make your life easier. Need to calculate averages, find the maximum value, or count how many rows are in a table. Functions have got you covered. By the time you are here, you'll also start optimizing your queries. This just means writing SQL in a way that makes it run faster, which is super useful when you're working with big datasets. Advanced SQL Alright folks, now we are getting to advanced stuff. This is where SQL starts to feel like a superpower. Don't worry if it sounds intimidating. By the time you get here, you'll already be pretty comfortable with the basics and intermediate concepts. 
Advanced SQL is all about doing things that are more complex and nuanced. For example, you might learn about window functions, which let you perform calculations across a set of rows without actually grouping them together. This is a game changer for things like running totals or ranking data. You will also explore subqueries, which are like queries inside other queries. These are great for when you need to do something really specific, like filtering data based on the results of another query. Another big thing at this stage is working with database design and indexing. These concepts help you understand how data is stored and accessed, which is crucial for optimizing performance. By the time you've mastered these advanced techniques, you'll be able to handle almost any data challenge that comes your way. Guys, before we move on, I try to make my content fun instead of boring. And in return, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy the content I make. Datacamp's data analyst in SQL career track. All right, my friends, let's talk about one of the best ways to level up your SQL skills. If you're serious about becoming a data analyst, Datacamp's data analyst in SQL career track. If you're not sure where to start or how to structure your learning journey, this track makes it super simple. It's designed to teach you everything you need to know from writing basic SQL queries to handling real-world datasets like a pro. The best part? It's interactive, which means you're not just watching videos or reading articles. You're actually doing the work, practicing queries, and applying what you learn to real datasets. That hands-on experience is so important, because it bridges the gap between learning SQL and actually using it in a job. And don't worry if you're starting from scratch. This program doesn't expect you to know a thing about SQL when you start. What I love about Datacamp's approach is how well-structured the curriculum is. You're not just learning random bits and pieces of SQL, you're building your skills step by step. By the time you finish, you'll know how to write complex queries, manipulate and analyze data, and even communicate your insights effectively. And that's something every data analyst needs to do. Oh, and did I mention they even offer certification? Once you've completed the track, you'll be prepared to pass the Associate Data Analyst in SQL certification, which is a great way to show off your skills to potential employers. So if you're looking for a guided, practical way to learn SQL and kickstart your career in data analytics, Datacamp's track is definitely worth checking out. Final thoughts. Alright guys, we have covered a lot in this video, from understanding what SQL is and why it's essential for data analysts, to diving into how you can master it step by step, starting with the basics, working your way through intermediate skills, and even tackling advanced concepts. And let's not forget about Datacamp's Data Analyst in SQL Career Track, which is such an awesome resource if you want a structured and hands-on way to learn. If you've been sitting on the fence about diving into SQL or starting a career in data analytics, now is the time to take action. SQL is one of those skills that not only opens doors, but also sets you apart in the job market. And the best part is that you don't need to be a coding wizard to get started. So here is my challenge to you folks. Go check out Datacamp and try their data analyst in SQL career track. It's an incredible way to build your skills, gain confidence and start working toward real career goals. Whether you're a total beginner or just looking to sharpen your skills, this is the perfect place to start. You'll find all the links you need in the description below. And who knows, there might even be some sweet discounts waiting for you. Don't just watch the video and move on. Take the next step and start automating your career growth today. As usual, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching, until next time.